Hey, Chad Burke here coming at you once again with a new setup. Uh, really digging the style coming down the pipe out there. Um, I'm just going to reflect on a few little drum tidbits. I'm not going to use uh, ear protection right now. Um, I figured I haven't been using ear protection for quite a while. I'm just starting to use ear protection now. Um, ear protection is very important. Um, these things are really loud, so basically, get your pull.
hands were all gone. You know, they call it uh, carpal tunnel. But have you seen Corporal Kirshner lately? I mean, really, what's going on in the WWE Hall of Fame? Woo! Okay, hands are starting to come back. Woo! Okay, I'm a local band, which would make me local, but I'm not in the city right now. Um, it feels like I'm playing with somebody else's arm. So like when I'm hitting the drums, the drumstick actually feels kind of flimsy, like a limp. You know, like you're grabbing some of the things, just going. Ow! So it's. guarantee their sticks. I stand by Vic Firth. Maybe it's me personally, right? really good all of a sudden so that's a good thing Everything's in its right spot. It's not really super portable for like say concert series, but uh, definitely a good studio kit. I like it in here. Got lucky. I mean, this place is styrofoam ceilings. I mean, you can't lower ceilings, you know, it gets that really tight sound, kind of like a tight vacuum, kind of like inside of a light bulb, you know, when you get that frizzle fry. You got a really hot sound inside of that blown glass. So, good job, Marshall.
work out this part. This is called uh, working out on the drums. One. Try to get that X hat to stay closed. <laughs>